Hi there, I'm Denise Richardson for Houdini.com. We all know that saving for retirement is something you're supposed to start doing as soon as you enter the workforce, but fewer and fewer of us are actually doing it until very much later, and that's a problem. But then what? How do you catch up? Can you catch up? Here to answer that and much, much more is David Bach, best-selling author of, among other books, Start Late, Finish Rich. Baby boomers, the time is here. It's not coming anymore. Are we in trouble? Well, we are in trouble, and we're in trouble because so many of us have put off saving money. You know, I always joke that at 30 we think about it, at 40 we worry about it, and at 50 we hyperventilate. And, and really, that's why I wrote Star Late Finish Rich. I was doing all these workshops and seminars, and I would have a lot of people come up to me in their late 40s and early 50s and say, you know what, David, I blew it. It's too late for me. What do I do? And what they were really saying to me is, I've given up. So do you have a lottery ticket for me? Yeah, really? <laughs> and, 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 and my message is really simple. No, don't stop. Don't give up. Because the truth is, if you're 50 right now, 50, by the way, is the new 30. And so if you're 50, it's not too late. The key is to get started. And I would always start with something simple. It's literally saving an extra 5 to $10 a day. Because the good news is, if you're in your 50s and you happen to be watching right now, chances are your kids are out of the house finally. And so you finally have some money coming in. that you're, It's not all going out to the children unless you've got college costs. And one of the things I tell baby boomers, by the way, is stop paying all those college costs because you've got to fund your retirement. So the key for you if you're watching right now and, you're, and you feel like you're behind, a couple things, really simple. One, you have to pay yourself first faster. So that means that the first person gets paid when you get a paycheck, it's got to be you. 10%, 15%? Well, honestly, if you're really behind, you need to get as high as 25%. So I always look in terms of hours. One hour a day of your income is a great place to start. That's 12.5% of your gross income. Mm -hmm. If you are, if you're working, uh, you know, 40, 50 hours a week, I want you saving an hour to two hours a day of your income. And so, for those, you know, baby boomers watching, the key is, save money, pay yourself first, but make it automatic. You have to save the money automatically. There are so many people right now who are on the edge financially. They're maxed out in their credit cards. They are in the throes of losing their homes, and they're they're crashing. Everything's crashing around them. What do they do? Well, here's what you really have to do. You have to go on what I call a debt diet. <laughs> You've got to cut what you spend. It's so, you know, you can go, well, oh, duh. But no, really, that's what you have to do. You have to look at where do you spend money and start being more honest with yourself. One, do I have to have this? Or two, do I just like to have it? Mm -hmm. I mean, the average American is saving less than 3% of their income. You mentioned little ways to save money. Can you give us a few tips? I'd pull out, I'd pull out your bills, and I'd look at every fixed expense you have. Cell phone, cable bill, gym membership, utilities. I just go right through your list and I call every single company and I'd look for a better deal. And so it's possible to get one. You will save hundreds of dollars in a matter of hours by just doing that. You'll get a better deal on your cell phone, you'll get a better deal on your cable. And, and the easiest way to get a better deal is to call these companies and say, I quit. I'm canceling my cable. Because then they're trained to keep you on the phone. And, and, and keep you working with them. So they'll say, well, wait a minute, why are you leaving? Well, because you know, I'm, I'm looking for ways to save money right now. I mean, it's a recession, I need to cut back. Well, we have a special package right now for the next six months. Maybe we could switch you to blah, 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 blah. And I'm telling you, whenever we do our makeover shows and we just start there, we find two, three, four, five hundred dollars a month in savings just by doing that, just by renegotiating every deal you've got. Absolutely, David Bach, thank you so much. Thank you so much. I'm Denise Richardson for Houdini.com.